Hello, it's Bart here, and welcome back to Scooby Doo Night of 100 Frights. Last time we began going through this very, very big manor, and we are now continuing on in that with Panic in the Attic. I think that's what it said. Or is this all scared upstairs part? Whatever. I think it was just all scared upstairs. Get out of here, Creeper. You're all jokes. I honestly feel like this game might be better without the ability to destroy the enemies. It would add more challenge. And more sneaking around. Because if you give me power ups for sneaking around, but then they also give you power ups for other things. Okay, Scooby. We just gotta twist around. No! There's so many Scooby snacks I just want. I can't even reach them. It was nice to attempt to. Who knows how much this next snack is gonna have. Was likely way too much. No witches allowed. There we go. Oh, we got a warp gate. Yeah, I was all scared upstairs. Part four that we did. 350. All our Scooby snacks are gone. Don't look down, Scooby Doo. Part one. And then we have the knight's helmet right there. That must be the ultimate goal. Oh, don't fall off. I'm not even sure if I'm going the right way. All of that for a sandwich? That was way too risky. Although to be fair, I don't even know if there's solid ground below me. I'm just gonna go ahead and assume it there isn't. Okay, those Scoopy snacks may indicate that there is. But I'm still not taking any chances. And that's the beginning. So where to next? Oh, down here? And then down there again. Just gotta avoid the spooky spider. There we go, perfect. Give me all these Scooby Snacks. Ouch. I don't think I could defeat that. Whoa, do not flame me straight into a pit. go. Excellent. And then now is it time for Don't Look Down Scooby-Doo Part 2. Perfect. Okay, it looks like we gotta do some basic climbing. So I need this Scooby snack. I've already figured out this game, judging by all the snack gates. Ouch. I'm all the way up here, but those Scoopy Snacks are down there. So... Time to backtrack. There we go. Excellent. I hate the enemies with projectile so much. Uh oh, it's a creeper. Okay, creeper has been destroyed. And that's the third and final key. Excellent. Gotta go back for these Scooby Snacks. 
no Scooby Snack left behind. Tower in the Tower, Part 1. Are we supposed to go up or down? I'm not even sure. There's a save point here. That's a new monster. Hmm. I don't Scoopy has any way to flow. And the fan's not pushing me up. There's a lot of areas in this game, from what I remember, where you need certain gadgets that you don't have. I'm gonna assume that this is one of those times. Those silly spiders are so hard to deceive. Thank you very much, game. Gotta make sure I'm actually jumping on the right platform. Whoa! Oh, don't fall, please. I might be able to reach that. No, I cannot. I'm not gonna even attempt it. Oh, I'm missing another gadget. Probably a gadget allows me to jump up there. Panic in the attic, part two. Where's Panic in the attic, part one? Go. What? You missed some Scooby snacks. Oh well. I mean, not oh well. I have to go back, but I can't go back up. Not good. Not good at all. I don't fancy dying, so I'm going to continue on charging 24/7 with my helmet. If I get, it will help me dodge getting hit. And if I ain't, okay, we just looped. So that's good news for me. Ew. That makes sense. Panic in the Attic, part three. We're making fantastic progress. Get out of here. Goodbye. Thank you very much. And that's another witch down. And what's up here? Some Scooby Snacks and the key. Excellent. Boom. Out of here. Even more Scooby Snacks. And even more Scooby Snacks. Whoa. Alright, we did it. Time to go to Panic in the Attic Part 4. There we go. Oh, Caveman. Goodbye, Caveman. Yeah, I could probably grab that. These cavemen are so annoying. Thank you very much. I'm not even sure if I got that. Did I get those Scooby Snacks? Only one way to find out. Oh, I did not. Now I have them. You have almost a thousand Scooby Snacks, but that's probably not even enough. We must need more Scooby Snacks. Oh wow. These jumps look tricky. Hopefully I don't need a thousand Scooby Snacks. And if I do, we're pretty much gonna make it. So I'm not gonna worry about it. There we go. I can go ahead and grab these Scooby Snacks. Scoop. Joseph Geronimo is gone. Easy. I'm still not seeing the difficulty that I was imagining as a child. 
emphasis on the imagined part. Okay, let's try this again. Close enough. I got a whole box of Scooby Snacks for my troubles. Oh, those barrels are aggressive. We need 400 Scooby Snacks. Snack gate unlocked. Dark and Stormy Night Part 1. Okay, so this is gonna be an exciting thing, isn't it? Silly creepers. They need to get out of here. Perfect. All creepers eradicated. And boom. Boom. Alright, now we got rid of the creepers. I can actually focus on what's going on. It looks like we need to hit this switch. And then what? Quickly run? Okay, now the gate is open. I could have sworn it was already open. Maybe it closed over time. Oh, that's a slippery roof. No way I'm getting those Scooby Snacks right now. Maybe with the power up that we don't have. Perhaps. I don't trust anything this game has to do with fire. I think fire might insta kill you. Or fire to your thing so I can progress. Thank you very much. There we go. Yes. Excellent. Stupendous. Okay, I need to do a roundabout, I guess. There we go. Oh, we could probably go down here for this. Yes, we can. Oh, don't fall off. There we go. We have a 708 Scoopy Snacks. Hopefully that's enough. A Dark and Stormy Night Part 2. Oh, it looks like we have our friend Shaggy over here. Being taunted by Ghost of Geronimo. There we go. I need all these Scooby Snacks. Just oh, hang in there, Shaggy. Hang in there. Hello. Zoinks, I know something scary is behind that door up there. Be careful, Scoob. Save your progress if you get a chance, pal. So then where am I supposed to go? Up here? Yeah, it looks like it. Oh, okay. Perfect. There we go. Uh-oh. Am I lacking a power-up? No, I'm just being silly. Grab these Scooby Snacks. It looks like there's a switch we can hit. Oh, that's very useful. It deactivated all the annoying fire. But it might only be temporary, so I need to be careful. Give me these Scooby Snacks. Oh, that's the beginning of the entire area. So if I fall down there, I have to go all the way there again. Oh, that's so cool. See, look at these unique inventive ideas. I love it. Either that or I just remembered you can do this. I was actually expecting maybe an air gust. Not exactly 
Shaggy. Shaggy proves useful once again. Whoever said Shaggy was useless is wrong. Alright, let's go through. We have zero Scoobies left. Oh, there's a save point right there. Good. Allow me to introduce myself. I am the mastermind. Oh, I'm the reason you're here. Who are? I'm the one who made Professor Graham disappear. Well, Dad? I'm also the one who's brought back all of your old foes. Oh, no. But why? That is a mystery you will never solve. And one more thing. I'm the one who's kidnapped all your friends. <laughs> Roma! Scooby-Doo! See if you can get past this fiendish fright. You remember the Black Knight. <laughs> <laughs> Roma, he was appeared. We'll worry about that later, Scooby. Watch out! It's the Black Knight. Oh no! Uh oh. <laughs> so how do I defeat the Black Knight? Well, this music. Okay. There's a cloud. Interesting. I think the switch didn't do anything. Let's see. Nope, that's not working. Hmm. Maybe I need to wait for them to stop. There we go. That makes sense. All I had to do is wait for them to stop. It looks like this boss will take four hits. Boom. Okay, this is a pretty easy first boss. But it's the first boss, so... It's literally just hit the switches at the right time. And dodging these axes, apparently. Out. Why isn't the Black Knight coming over here? Oh, maybe I have to lure them. Oh, you're being annoying, game. Okay, let's try luring the Black Knight now. Nope, you were not close enough. Come on. This music is great. Okay, let's try this again. There we go. Perfect. Okay, let's rescue Velima. My glasses! Help me look for them, Scooby. We're okay. Something fishy's going on here, Scooby. We solved the mystery of the Black Knight ages ago. Have you found any clues? I don't know. There was a spooky groundskeeper. A spooky groundskeeper? Yeah, and ghosts and, and monsters. Scooby-Doo, you know there's no such thing as monsters and ghosts. Remember well, it looks like it is. Black Knight? We thought he was a monster, but really he was just a guy in a mask. Aha! I found him! Jinkies! The lenses got knocked out! Where's some lenses, Velma? Thanks, Scooby. I can't see a thing without these. Jinkies, Scooby! It's the Creeper! The Creeper? Where? He's... he's everywhere! Run, Scooby! Velma, wait! 
I don't see any creeper. Why, hello there. Hmm. Hello. I'm Professor Alexander Graham. <laughs> and you found one of my amazing invention crates. Let's see now. What's in this one? Uh, oh, here we go. Well, inside this box, you should either find my automated herring scraper or my anti-stick galoshes. Oh, looks like it's the galoshes. With these, you can walk across any stick galoshes, you say? And not get stuck. And best of all, <laughs> they're banana flavored. Oh, um, banana. <laughs> my favorite. <laughs> Don't eat them, Scooby. These might be useful. It seems like it will be very useful. Where did this take us? It takes us back to Cower in the Tower. Oh, and a Black Knight token. Nice. We can't even use that. Ooh, Warp Gate. Anyways, that's it for this video. I'll see you in the next one when we go to... I don't know where we should go next. Most likely back, but where to? Well, I'll see you then.